Namaste. In this video, I will tell you how to make a connecting road 2D graph mechanism in Python. So, let's see how does it work. So, when I change the value of theta, as you can see, the crank radius and length of the connecting road are moving. Here, you can see distance of piston from the crankshaft is 536 in units okay so let's try to understand how does our code work so first of all I import a library from matplotlib.pyplot that is used to plot a graph then I import a library numpy that is used for converting the value of our theta into degrees remember all the values are getting are currently in a radians so I am going to convert into degree. So that is the reason I am importing the numpy. After that I am going to import the ipy which is interactive. You see the slider bar. The slider bar is come from, from ipy widgets. So first of all I am going to define a function that is f theta. So basically this function defines theta what is uh, what is the value of theta because I am going to change and you can see whenever I change the value of theta my graph is just changed so now let's try to understand remember uh, in this graph uh, I take the crank radius is 5 cm and length of the connecting rod is 10 cm you can just say it's a unit okay now here you can see x a y a y c x b y b x c so let's try to understand what is x a y b here you can see x a y a is zero so this point is x a y a that is the fixed point okay so here this point is zero so it means that this point does not move along x axis not y axis it remain fixed at this point now let's see what is x b and y b here x b and y b so i need the value of this point to reach this point what i am going to do is x b 5 cos theta radians I will reach at this point and x b uh, r into sin theta then I will reach this point so by using those two point I can reach here okay now x c x b plus square root of 10 square minus y b square so let's try to understand how this line work so as you can see the x c point is this and uh, is this length so to get this length we we are going to use a pythagoras theorem so from triangle b d c we know that the length of connecting node is 10 and we will get the value of y b from here that is 5 sin theta so what we don't know is the length of x c so by using pythagoras theorem we know the hypotenuse of 10 square minus y b square and we will get the value of x c okay now x comma y x a y a that is the fixed point that is 0 0 comma 0 so here is the fixed point after that x b y b i already told you how we calculate the x b and y b so it's not a problem and x c as I told you and y c here you can see the y c is 0 because it is moving along this line if I give the value of y c for example 1 or 2 it will become offset from the center of the crank radius that is the reason the y c is 0 now after that I equal to plot x comma y and axis equal so that the graph show exactly what it looks like 
and print distance from the piston crankshaft xc so basically x is the distance x is xb from here to here that is the xb plus square root of the, that i told you the pythagoras theorem after that i just use interactive plot f theta 0 360 if anybody don't understand how does the ipi widget work make sure you watch our previous videos of how ipi widgets work uh, this is so this is done for this video i hope you like this video if anybody have any query or doubts make sure you ask in the comments thanks for watching and have a great day